Welcome to Modern Agri-Machines. Today, we're exploring the date palm, a tree celebrated for its nutritious fruits and economic significance. In this video, we'll dive into the origins, economic and nutritional values of dates, and take a closer look at how farmers worldwide cultivate, care for, and process these unique fruits. Let's get started. Date palms have a long history with origins tracing back thousands of years to the Middle East and North Africa. In these regions, date palms were not only a staple, but a symbol of life and prosperity in arid climates. Today, date palms are grown worldwide, especially in regions like California, North Africa, and the Middle East. Globally, dates are an economically valuable crop. With high export demand, especially in Europe and Asia, countries like Egypt, Saudi Arabia, and Iran lead in production. The US and Mexico also contribute to global supplies with dates providing jobs, supporting local economies, and fostering international trade. Date seeds are a nutrient-dense source with multiple health benefits. They are rich in dietary fiber, which supports digestion, reduces constipation, and helps regulate blood sugar levels, making them beneficial for people with diabetes. Packed with antioxidants like flavonoids and phenolics, date seeds also contribute to heart health and reduce inflammation. In addition, they contain essential minerals such as potassium, magnesium, and copper, which support nerve function, stabilize blood pressure, and strengthen bones. Date seed oil is increasingly used in skincare products due to its moisturizing and anti-aging properties. Thanks to their fiber, antioxidants, and minerals, date seeds offer valuable nutritional and health benefits, making them an excellent addition to both food and natural health products. Growing and caring for date palms requires understanding the climate, soil, and specific techniques to ensure the trees thrive and yield a good harvest. Date palms are well suited to hot, dry climates with plenty of sunlight, typically grown in desert regions with high temperatures and low rainfall. The soil should have good drainage as date palms cannot tolerate water logging. Sandy loam soil rich in organic matter is ideal for growth. Before planting, the soil should be tilled and enriched with organic fertilizer to provide initial nutrients for the young trees. Date palms are commonly grown from seeds or young plants. Growing from seeds requires patience, as it can take five to eight years for the trees to bear fruit. Therefore, commercial farms often use saplings to shorten the growing period. Once young plants reach about one, two years old, farmers begin intensive care to encourage healthy growth. Watering is crucial, especially during the early growth phase. The trees need regular watering, but they should not be overwatered. Drip irrigation is typically used to maintain soil moisture and avoid water wastage. Date palms also require periodic fertilization with organic compost and potassium supplements to support strong growth and high yields. Pruning is essential to remove dead leaves and maintain airflow, which helps prevent pests and diseases. Farmers must also inspect the trees frequently to detect any early signs of disease and take preventive measures as needed. The harvest process for dates is a careful and labor-intensive task crucial for ensuring the quality and taste of the fruit. Date palms reach full fruit-bearing maturity between seven to 10 years. And depending on the region, harvest season typically falls between August and October. As dates grow in clusters high up in the palms, reaching the fruit requires either ladders or specialized machinery like cherry pickers, particularly in large-scale farms. Workers carefully ascend the trees using small baskets or large cloth sheets to collect ripe dates without damaging them. In some places, workers may climb the palms directly, wearing special harnesses for safety. Harvesting dates involves skill to prevent bruising 
and to avoid knocking the fruit onto the ground, which could impact quality. Depending on the variety, dates may be harvested at different stages of ripeness. Some dates are picked while still semi-ripe and allowed to ripen post-harvest, while others, like medjool dates, are collected once they reach a soft, fully ripened state on the tree. Farmers inspect each cluster to ensure that the dates meet size and quality standards before detaching them. The process of sorting, selecting, washing, and drying dates is a crucial step to ensure product quality before they reach the market. After harvesting, dates are transported to the processing facility to begin the sorting process. Here, dates are selected based on size, color, and ripeness. Any dates with defects, such as bruising or damage, are removed, leaving only those that meet standards for quality and appearance. The dates are thoroughly washed to remove any dirt and debris that may have adhered to them during harvesting. The washing is typically done with clean, high-pressure water to ensure sanitation without affecting the structure or softness of the fruit. Next is the drying stage. Dates can be sun-dried naturally or dried in industrial ovens. The drying process reduces moisture in the dates, extending shelf life and preserving their distinctive flavor. In drying ovens, the temperature is carefully controlled to ensure the dates do not become overly dry, keeping a soft, chewy texture. Finally, the dried dates are packaged in various sizes and weights. This process not only retains the nutritional value, but also ensures the dates meet the highest quality standards when they reach consumers. Many companies use vacuum sealing to maintain freshness. Packaged dates are then distributed locally or exported to markets worldwide. This is an overview of the journey of dates from the farm to the processing line. We hope this video has given you insight into how date cultivation contributes to global agriculture. If you found this video helpful, please like, subscribe, and stay tuned for upcoming videos. Thank you for watching.